Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Raylynn and I film cash stuffing content here on my channel. Today's video is going to be a cash unstuffing. It has sure been a very long time since I've done one of these, but I'm going to go ahead and just shoot the shot. So <laughs> I apologize in advance if it's a complete disaster, but we will get through it, right? Okay, first things first, I'm going to be unstuffing my 52 envelope savings challenge from Lux Designs. As you guys can see, I we did not complete it, but the purpose of this challenge for us was to save for furniture, specifically a couch. And there has been times where I found things off marketplace, like our dining set outside and pulled out of here for that too. So, um, I did not stuff this in order whatsoever. It's kind of just like whatever we had, we stuffed it. And so I know I stuffed like more money in some of the envelopes too than what it actually says. And yeah, like not all of them are completed. So it's going to be a total mystery on what's in here. So I'm excited and I just had to unstuff this with you guys. So, and I know it's been a long time since I even like stuffed any of these envelopes. So we'll go ahead and unstuff this and I'm going to show you guys my list of things that I need to unstuff for. So to be honest, I haven't even cash stuffed the last two weeks. I just needed a break. And so um, these are the purchases that we put on our debit card while we weren't cash stuffing. So our new couch that we got, it's not new, but it's new to us. Um, it was $850. So I hope I have at least that in here. Um, we shall see. So I will speed this part up for you guys. All right, so everything is out of the envelopes. So I'm gonna go ahead and just unfold everything and put it here on my cash tray to count.
All right, you guys, that was a lot of work. Oh my goodness. So <laughs> there's a lot of ones here, more than I thought. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and count this up. Ooh, I don't know if we're gonna have the whole 850. All right, so I think I'm just gonna divide these ones into 20s. So here we go. Okay, I, th oh, I don't know. Did I just do that right? I think so. Okay, that is gonna be cutting it so close, you guys. I'm sweating, okay. my gosh okay beat it by three bucks that's insane so yay we this is exciting that is really crazy i feel like stuff like this happens to me all the time i'm just like super close i don't know does I, does anybody else do that or like sometimes i don't know like things just equal out exact for me and i love when that happens but this made me nervous because that's a lot of money and we need to put this money back in our bank account to replenish our buffer. So that's exciting. So we have $853 to put back in our bank. Yay. Okay, you guys. So let's go ahead and roll on with this cash unstuffing video. So I know that like, for instance, my Christmas envelope, I don't think I have that much in that envelope because we have most of it in our high yield savings account. So I'm just going to have to make a note on this page with whatever I don't have in the envelope to transfer the rest. So yeah, um, let's go ahead and just start. I can check this off. So there's eight. I had 8.53. So that's done. My gosh, I am sweating. That was a lot. I was so nervous. All right. Um, We'll just start, we'll go up. Okay, so Black Friday, I know is in my holiday binder. So I need to pull 45 and you guys look at this. I switched it to November and I love, love these inserts so much. They're from Viri over at Get It Done. And it just matches the vibe of this binder because I have it like black and white. So Black Friday is back here. And I know this was for um, Bath and Body Works. They had like, it was like their candle day sale. Does anyone else love the candles from Bath and Body Works? I'm obsessed. They are the best candles ever. Um, but yeah, they had a sale going on. It was based almost, it, I think it was actually came out cheaper than their candle day sale because they gave me an extra 25% off. And so I was like, um, yeah, I'm doing that. <laughs> so 45 for that. Oh, and then there's another Black Friday one for 15. So 60. I need out of here. So 20, 40, 60. 
you know what? I should probably keep this separate so I don't have to recount all of this again because that's a lot. I'm just gonna put all this money back here. All right, I hope that's straight. So 20, 40, 60, 5, 10, 20. So we have 20, 30, 35, and 40 left in Black Friday. I wasn't gonna count, but might as well. Okay, so those are done. Personal hygiene, well, since I'm in the holiday, We'll go to Christmas and just see what I have in here in cash. So I need 250. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So I need to transfer 100. So transfer. 150 from high yield for Christmas. And then I can get rid of this too because, yeah. And I know I have less than 600 in there now. That's crazy. All right, you know what? Maybe I should just, yeah, we'll leave it like that because that makes sense. I have, I took a hundred and I need to transfer another hundred. So yeah, I think I have 550. That's depressing. It goes so quick. Has anybody else started their Christmas shopping yet? I was so excited because we've never saved this much for Christmas before, but you guys this year, so my daughter, the um, my six-year-old daughter, um, she's not really into toys anymore. And the stuff that she's asked for, I mean, she doesn't ask for a lot. I kind of have to bribe it out of her. And um, just the things that we want to get our kids this year are pricey. So um, their bikes were completely destroyed from the summer sun. So we are replacing both of their bikes. I'm trying to whisper because I don't want them to hear me. And, um, my six year old is a starting to get into like video game stuff and it is not my decision. My husband's a gamer and she wants to be just like him, but it's actually really cute because they'll play like Minecraft together. Like they set up dates with each other to play Minecraft. So she has like a little Nintendo thing and plays with him on, while well, he's gaming on the PC with her, but they're on the same teams. It's super cool. And I love that for them. But the stuff that she's asked for is like accessories for the Nintendo and it is not cheap. So it's like this money is going so quick, but that's okay. She's going to be so excited and it's going to be so worth it. So yeah, sorry I rambled off. Um, clothing is next. Okay, there's nothing else in the holiday binder. Yeah. Okay, so clothing is in here. And I need to pull 20, so that was easy. And honestly, um, I've just been kind of rounding it to the nearest five for me because I don't really stuff $1 bills or anything like that. And it, I kind of like have a hard time making change with certain things. So just to make it easier, I just round it to the nearest five. Sometimes I if I do have ones in the envelope, I'll make exact change, but yeah. Um, coffee is in here and that needs 40. And you guys, I only have 20, but like I said, I didn't cash stuff for the last two weeks. So I would have technically had 40 in here. So I'll just do 20. So that way my numbers don't get messed up. So, and the next is personal hygiene. And that is great. See? <laughs> okay. 
you know what? I think I had, we will come back because I know I had other bills in the Black Friday envelope and that just might help me. So I needed 60 from there. So yeah, I'll put that back. What am I doing? Right? Yeah, that's right, because I did have a, a hundred, so 40, I think. What did I do? I'll catch it, I'll catch it in my edit if I messed up. So, okay, 20, 40, 60, so. We'll just do this and sorry if this is like driving you nuts but this is how my brain works so here we go five for personal hygiene and now it has 20 40 50 55 left oh i just wrote on my finger okay so go ahead and add all this up So I should have 205 here. So let's just count that. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 205. Okay, and then plus 853. Holy cow, $1,058 going back to our bank account. Yay, that's gonna be so nice to see that. Ugh. It's been giving me a heart attack every time I log into our bank account because so much money is missing. So this will make me feel much, much better. So, all right. All right, you guys, that is all I had for today's cash unstuffing video. I hope you all enjoyed it. I felt like it was kind of a train wreck, but whatever. Um, <laughs> thank you guys for sticking around if you made it this far. Um, if you enjoyed it, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.